Decimals Bingo. This is a digital bingo game, and this is the Thanksgiving version. So all of the instructions are on slide two. There are 26 different bingo cards. So if you have more than 26 students, you can just click on one of the slides on the left-hand side and come up here to slide duplicate. And you can duplicate as many different cards as you need. Now, all of the decimals that you're going to call out to the students are on slide three. So students are going to listen and they're going to find that decimal on their bingo card. So as you use them, just click and hold on the edge, move them to the right hand side. That way you know which ones you've used. At the end of the game, you can just click on the undo arrow. All of the decimals go right back into place. I give the students editing rights so they can scroll up and down till they find the bingo card that they want. I instruct my students just to click in one of the bingo chips and then type their name or their initials. And that way they've claimed the card. So other students that are looking for a card, they can see that this one's taken and they need to find a different card. So as you're giving these decimals to the students, they're going to find them on their card. They're going to click and hold on the edge of a chip and then move it into place. Once they get five in a row, they can call out bingo. And if you want to check their answers, just have them move the chips to the side. And that way you can check and see if they're correct. Now at the end of the game, the students can come up to the undo arrow. Click it, click it repeatedly. All of the chips go right back into place and their name comes off the chip. And that way, if you want to play again, they could scroll up and down until they find a different card and then play a second time. So this is the Thanksgiving version of Decimals Bingo.